you know, while I'm in a video making mood, let's do another one. Let's make sure that your cross conveyor, micro switch, and magnetic clutch on the pinwheel is working properly. What it is, you got, well, I got to stop this. I can't flip the camera while I'm talking, so it'll be a separate video. Um, here we go. Watch this. Okay, if you notice, when the pins come up, you got these two rollers. They're never up at the same time unless you're full of pins. See how one lifts and the other lifts. One lifts, the other lifts. They don't lift at the same time normally. So what's going to happen here, I'm going to lock the pin gate. Say you got full pins, you lift both rollers at that time. Normally they're spaced down, they don't raise up, but when they're both raised up like that, your pinwheel stops. This little switch right here is what does it. Normally if you watch it, there'll be one up and one down at the same time. I'm going to cycle it again here. Wait for it to come around here. So if this isn't adjusted right, you're going to have a bunch of turn pan jams and mess up your pins. Watch how one raises and then the other. That switch is always pushed down. But if you lock up the pin gate, they both raise up, releases pressure on that switch. Pinwheel stops turning. I push the pin over the pin gate, pinwheel starts up again. So go to all your machines, lock the pin gate up, put two pins in like that, make sure your pinwheel does not turn. You know, your magnetic clutch could be bad or you might have an adjustment to make on your little roller there, but that's a pretty important one to have to keep from getting a bunch of turn pin jams. So do that to all your machines, just lock the pin gate, set two pins in there. Make sure your pinwheel does not turn. That's the almost useless information video of the day on your pinwheel magnetic clutch stop switch adjustment. Just to make sure, because whenever you get 10 in the deck, 10 in the turret, and you get one or two more pins up there, you don't want that pinwheel to keep feeding. Or if it's going down to set pins and you got 10 up top, there's sometimes that pinwheel needs to stop turning and quit feeding pins. And if your switch ain't set right, you're going to get a turn pan jam, which is a loud, say if your dog was in pain, it's about what it sounds like from the front. You'll hear a roop, roop, roop. That, that's the turn pan jam when the clutch is slipping. So whenever you hear that up front, just turn the machine off before you get pins in the belts because it'll cause them to jump up get caught in a belt and then you're gonna mark up one of your pins so anyways another video stick it in the file once you get down your list do this one take a look at the stuff see you later